Hey, this is Steve Stock with CoachAndTeachBaseball.com. I'm here today with Skyler, and I wanted to show you guys uh, one little tip on helping your little leaguers get their hand in the right position when they're using their bat, okay? One of the things, a lot of problems that kids do is they will choke over their hands. They get real strong, they're gonna really hit it, and they, they turn these hands over and end up dipping, dropping their hands. All kinds of bad things come from this. This is a hard habit sometimes to break with a little eager, but the best situation that you want is you want that bat out in your fingertips, nice and loose. What I tell my players is these knuckles right here, right there, when you knock on a door, you use your door knocking knuckles, okay? When you hold a bat, you want to line up those door knocking knuckles, just like that. A lot of times, here's a good tip with your little leaguers, I take a dry erase marker, okay? You highlight their knuckles with dry erase marker, okay? Another thing, a lot of batting gloves today, you'll find that they have black lines on them already so that you can see as a coach quickly whether they're lining up those door knocking knuckles when they hold the bat. So Skyler, if you don't mind, I'm gonna show one thing first and I'm gonna have you do it. I simply put my hands like this. There's my door knocking knuckles, right? Lined up. I lay my hand open like that. Skylar's gonna set the bat in my hand. Thank you. And then you close your fingers over it and gently close the hands. There's the door knocking knuckles, okay? So when I stand and I'm ready to hit, I've got those knuckles lined up. Do not have them crunch over and grab the bat like that. When you do that, you're gonna get dip in your swing. It's gonna be harder to come through. When you have your hands lined up with those door knocking knuckles, the hands are quick, they turn over quickly, get more explosive power. It may feel uncomfortable at first if a little guy's been doing this his whole life, but trust me, for their well-being as a baseball player, long-term success in their career in junior high, high school, college, and beyond, hopefully, if that works, you want that nice light grip, nice quick hands, okay? Now Skylar, go ahead, you put your hands out and I'm gonna show you how we do it. I'll just have him line out, put his hands, I set it in there, he closes fingers, he's holding it, now close the hands and go to your stance. Here we go, take a look. He's got those door knocking knuckles lined up right there. Makes for a very quick swing, very quick hands, okay? I can't stress enough, get that, get that dry erase marker and run down their knuckles, or if they've got the batting glove, get the batting gloves with those little lines. It helps you as a coach be able to see if they're up at the plate and, and they're you know, 30 feet away from you, you can get a quick glance and see if, if, their, if their hands are set like that, okay? Very important. Very simple thing with the hands, but important to know. Thanks so much.